Happy Sunday to everybody. Boy, it's, the sun is out bright today. It's beautiful outside though, so no complaints. Part three. All right, so I, uh, I came up with a, um, an idea for a jacket. I was gonna spray paint it, as you guys know, silver. Uh, the jacket has turned out um, not silver as I want it to be, using the fabric paint. So um, typically when I make a jacket, I make it for my wardrobe, but because now I've decided to put some real metal metallic -y paint on this thing, uh, in order to get it that brilliant silver that I want it to be. It'll just be for this photo shoot since I decided to do that. Um, so today I'm gonna spray a different paint on here and we're gonna see if we can get the color I want. So stay tuned, more to come and you'll get the, I'll show you what paint I'm gonna use here in just a second. All right. So I'm changing my approach up. At the end of the day, uh, the jacket was not as shiny as I want it to be. So I picked up a new paint. It is not for fabric. Um, but it uh, may give me that chrome look that I'm looking for. I really want this jacket to be super silver, and currently it's not, as you saw. Uh, this is Rust-Oleum Metallic Bright and Shiny Silver, and I like the fact that that top is really chrome looking. And so we're gonna see what we can do with it. More to come. Here's the jacket um, as is, two cans of paint on it. It was the silver fabric paint. Um, I don't dislike it. I actually think that uh, it's pretty nice and I will probably keep something like this in my wardrobe. So, which means I'll end up making this again uh, at a later date. I bought enough paint to be able to just spray another jacket and, and do that. Um, but this is not what I want for my shoot. I want it to be super duper silver, super duper silver. And so I'm going to use this product here it is not made for fabrics, which means that I will not probably add it to my wardrobe. Um, but I'm going to spray this can of paint on here and I'm going to see if it makes a difference. So let me shake it up, come back, and I'll show you guys what I came up with. Give you my thoughts on it. More this is the before of these Converse All-Stars that I have, these cons. I've had them for years. I really like them. They already have like a metallic finish. And it actually looks really nice the way that they are. Um, but I want silver. So I'm gonna use this same paint and I'm gonna put it on uh, on these shoes. I'll spray one and then I'll uh, come back and show you what it looks like before and after. Hopefully they turn out good. Um, again, they're just for the photo shoot. Um, I know what I want it to look like and we'll go from there. More to come. So I've sprayed one of the shoes. You can clearly see the difference. Here's my before. It's kind of got a metallic-y kind of, I don't know, plum color to it. I always thought they were pretty dope. And here's the new one. And you can see how silver that looks. That is the look that I'm going for, for the actual jacket itself. I don't know if I'm gonna get it, but I'm getting as close as I can. Um, I have to be honest with you. I love the way it just turned out. And uh, so I'm gonna go ahead and spray the other shoe and then I'll show you everything when it's all said and done. More to come. All right, I, uh, I've emptied that can of the uh, silver the metallic finish, the new one, that's not made for fabric. It looks a lot more silver to me. Um, this jacket is gonna be stiff with three cans of paint on it. But I'm gonna let it air out. And, uh, and we're gonna see what it looks like once it's dry. I'll probably have to turn it inside out, um, button it, turn it inside out, and then dry it at some point just to uh, get it to loosen up a little bit, but I'm gonna let this thing air out though, so it doesn't smell so chemically. Um, it's gonna work out just fine for what I need it for. What I was really going after, although I like it, what I was really going after is what you see here on these shoes. And so the difference is very simple. Um, the shoe is leather. It's gonna take the paint very, very different, you know, as far as soakage than what, than what the uh, jacket is. Um, I probably had to like, I probably would have had to wash it in something or spray it with a base or something, just like a light mist. Um, but I didn't think about that out the gate. Um, and so if I decide to do this again to add something to my wardrobe, then I'll do it with that in mind. And I won't use this other paint that I used here on that product, on the jacket, because I don't want it to, you know, I want to use fabric paint. Um, I like the way this turned out. This is definitely gonna get used in a photo shoot. And um, I appreciate you guys following me along this journey. 
Um, I'm gonna make some last minute comments. Let me go and sit down and I'll be back in a second.